Hello everyone and welcome back to a cleaning motivational video. I haven't done one for a few weeks because of school holidays and just being too busy but my husband has taken Otto to the park for an hour or so and I am going to tackle the inside of our car. Now I don't do this often enough at all. Um, Otto eats a lot in there. It's got to a bit of a state. Rubbish everywhere. Bags in there that shouldn't be in there. Just stuff that just makes it a bit of a mess. So I thought I'd take you along and you can watch me clean the inside of my car and hopefully it gives you a bit of motivation to do your own car as well. So I'm just doing the inside today. If you do like cleaning motivational videos, pregnancy update videos, lifestyle videos, just nice general things, then do hit that subscribe button and be a part of this wonderful community I have here on YouTube. I'd love my channel to grow. Um, so if you could do that, also share videos, put the thumbs up button really helps the youtube algorithm see that people are enjoying my videos and sort of recommend them to other people that might not know about me um so yeah i'm gonna get straight on in let's go and see the inside of this car okay starting at the front not so bad at the front obviously lots of like stones and stuff on sort of the inside of the car here um lots and lots of is it gonna lots and lots of dust um a jumper that's just been left in here, a bottle cap from Otto's snacks, you know, just a bit of a broken face mask, um, just a little bit messy in the back front, but not too bad at all. Coming into the back now, this is where it gets a bit more crazy. We have a pram in here, um, lots and lots of bags, like IKEA bags, because we always recycle with our IKEA bags, but we're recycling and taking the recycling centre, Wellingtons, which not sure why they're in here for summer, but they are. Um, <laughs> reflective vest. Um, Otto's car seat. I'm going to take you around the other side to show you because that's sort of where most of the mess is. You can see sort of down here. So let's go round. Okay. So this is Otto's side. And as you can see, lots and lots of yucky, horrible mess underneath the car seat food, sand, twigs, anything, we're outside a lot, come into the car, he puts his feet on the stuff the side because obviously it's a backward facing seat to keep him as safe as possible, um, lots of rubbish on the floor to be tackled, so this is what I'm going to be doing and in the boot, not too bad at all, um, I'm just going to clean this mat and try and get some of the hair off. Um, yeah, because this is where the dogs go, because we take them for walks every day, obviously twice a day, um, and they always go in the car, because we always take them to the forest, um, so this is sort of where they come in, so I'm just going to take the mat out, give it a hoover, not going to do too much in the boot, because they're just going to make it hairy again, um, but just give it a slight tidy. So a few products I'm going to be using, I've got some Cross Olsen car shampoo, my Zaflora, oh! some window cleaner and some Bissell pet stain and odour sort of upholstery cleaner that I'm going to wipe some of the seats with as well. I've got my shark hoover and I'm going to tackle this car. <laughs>
I'm just going to use some of the car shampoo that I've diluted in some water just to wipe down any of the sort of sides which are dirty like down here and then the leather on the seats and the doors and just give that all a good wipe down um, and then on the upholstery part I'll use the Bissell <laughs> distraction but now I can get going again <laughs> so wiping this down <laughs> 